The basketball court, Campbell Hall's Austin McBroom has always looked at home. His coming out party came as just a freshman when he poured in 30 points in the 2008 State Division IV title game. But in a surprise move, McBroom has decided to put those same attributes to use on the gridiron this fall as a running back and receiver in the Viking offense. Someone told me love was only in the movies that don't exist in real life these days, no. But you showed me if I only just find the faith I need to believe. Anything is possible If you want it bad enough No, the sky ain't too high Test your limits You can feel unstoppable Incredible Almost there, I can see I'm so ready If you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the family. So today for Vlogmas J7. We're on seven? Uh, we're on seven, Ooh. so that makes that marks a week. So we got a couple weeks left. But for today, I thought of this great genius idea to go to Austin's old high school. What? You've been wanting to go for a long time. I actually went to my high school a couple months ago when I was in Florida and I was telling him, I think it would be a good idea if you went to your old high school just because it could be really healing and it could just be nice to like share with the AIDS family like where you went. For you, I feel like it's like an even bigger deal just because you were like really big into sports and you played like every sport at the school. So many memories. So it'll be nice for you to like go back to like your football field and like your basketball gym. Are we really doing this right now? Yeah. <laughs> Guys, it's been like 13 years. Yeah. That's crazy. All right. And you know, we have to bring Nate's family with us. So let's all go together. Come on, let's go. All right, guys, we just pulled up to Austin's <laughs> high school. This feels so weird. Campbell Hall. Ooh, Campbell Hall. Wow, it's been a long time since you've been here, huh? Oh, little kitties. This is K through 12. It's really cool. This is like one of the most prestigious private schools in California. But no, it's been, um, 13 years, 12 years, something like mm -hmm. 13 years. Oh wow. my God, you make me feel old. Wait, what year did you graduate? Oh, 11. 2011. Wait, you graduated in 2011? Yes. <laughs> I, I graduated know. in 2009. You're a baby. So over here is K through 8th? Uh-huh. And then on the left side is the high school. Cool. So we're going to park on the left side. Did you go here? Only high school, right? Yes. So you got here in ninth grade as a freshman and then you left as a senior. Yes. And then you went to like four different colleges. <laughs> Basically. Oh my God, this is bringing back so many memories. Okay, wait, don't show me, don't show me. Is Let this me a cafeteria? Let me park. Let me wow, park. this school is really nice. Holy crap. Look at the football okay, field. Can we wait until we get out the car? No, this is so nice. Oh my God, should Elle come here? Can we just wait until I park, okay. please? Happy holidays, Ace family. As you guys know, every year for Vlogmas, we do giveaways. So this year, it's nothing different. We're gonna be giving away $100 a day to a lucky winner. All you have to do to have a chance to win is make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button, turn on our post notifications, make sure you like each video, give it a thumbs up, and comment something positive in each video. Last but not least, follow both of us on Snapchat. That's all you gotta do. All right, Ace family. I'm back at Campbell Hall where I graduated high school in 011. I know, don't make fun of me, I'm getting old. I'm literally stepping foot on campus again. It's been 13 years plus. This is where I went to high school, 9th through 12th. This is where I got my scholarships. This is where I played, I was hooping, playing baseball, playing football. I did it all here. This is where you play football? And I got in trouble here. Like on this field, right here? So yeah, so here Wait, we are. Wait, highlights here? Yes. Girl, you gotta see my football okay, highlights. Yeah, I don't, I don't nah, know nah, nah, nah. Ace yeah. family don't really know about my football highlights. So this was 
my field, okay? When I played, this was, they called it Austin McBoom's field, okay? This is all turf. This is where I used to score a numerous of touchdowns. I'll show you guys a little something right here. Let them check the stats. Yeah, I got a couple. Yeah. I don't draw the ball. Nah. Now I never fumble. I'm the MVP. Yeah. Now I feel like Russell. Yeah. Feel like John Morant. Hey. Need a triple double. Yeah. Told him check the stats. Hey. Yeah, I got a couple. I don't draw the ball. Yeah. Now I never fumble. Yeah. I'm the MVP. Yeah. Now I feel like Russell. Hey. Yeah, I need it now. Told him on the lay. Hey. I've been moving dog. Yeah. yeah, I'm on the way. I don't hear the talk. Don't care what they say. Hey. I don't got no patience. Yeah. I can't ever wait. Yeah. I've been trying to get it. So now we're gonna head over to where I used to always buy food. I never brought my food. Did anybody in high school ever make them food for themselves? I did. You did? <laughs> yes, I she did. Would. So I used to always just buy my food on campus. So I'm gonna take you guys over here. Let's see what they got. We're actually a little hungry. All right. So here we are. Where I used to get my food. Let's see what they got. Quesadillas. Chicken nuggets. I want a corn dog. Can we get a corn dog? Curly fries. Cool curly fries up. So I got a corn dog and some cookies. Okay, the cookies in high school and school in general are always the best cookies. And then we got some curly fries and some chicken. Yeah, she went all out. Thanks so much for online. I'm gonna just pay for everybody's food. Okay? So since I'm alumni here, I'm gonna pay for everybody in line. Alright? Yeah. So I got I got all you guys in line, okay? I got you. It's on my bill. Alright? Alright. Alright. All right. All right. Y'all keep moving, y'all keep moving, keep moving. I'm gonna come check y'all out too. Alright. We might have to play one on one too. Appreciate it. Alright, bro. How's it going? Have a good one. Impacting the community. Have a good one. That's what I'm talking about. I used to be here. My family. Hey, you're back. Yep, I'm back. Stay in school. That's all I ask. Stay in school. You smacking them corn dogs? Oh my goodness. This is a spot. Hope these cookies are good as the corn dogs. These oh, chicken are amazing with the barbecue sauce. Look at that. Okay. Okay. So we're feeling all the love here. We really like this school. We really like how it's evolved. And we're thinking about elk coming here. Definitely. You definitely see how coming here. So now I'm gonna take you guys to the best part of my high school, which was the basketball gym. Over here. Right now, I think they got the nutcracker going on, so we can't really see the gym, but you can see the vibes. These were my glory days. I was dropping like 30s in here. Yeah, feel like John Moran. Yeah. Need a triple double. Hey. Told him check the stats. Yeah, I got a couple. Yeah. I don't draw the ball. Nah. Now I never fumble. Oh. I'm the MVP. Yeah. Now I feel like Russell. Yeah. Feel like so this is the gym. I basically got my scholarship in. Basically. One memory I can share with you guys is when I was a freshman, Drew Holiday was a senior. For those of you who don't know who Drew Holiday is, he plays for the Bucks, starting point guard for the Bucks. And uh, we won a CIF championship together. And in that game, as a freshman, I scored 30 points. Woo! Shit. I ain't gonna lie, my man Drew was out because of foul trouble, but I picked up the team, you feel me? <laughs> Drew, I know you remember that big dog. The basketball court, Campbell Hall's Austin McBroom has always looked at home. His coming out party came as just a freshman when he poured in 30 points in the 2008 State Division IV title game. <laughs> no, all love to Drew Holiday. He's over there killing it. To all his brothers, all the holidays out there, all in the league. Shout out to them, but this was the gym we all played at. You guys don't understand how significant this gym really is to me. I used to live an hour away to commute to high school every day. What high school kid do you know that drives an hour from their home to school, ninth grade, 12th grade? You know anybody doing that? No, but I did it because my parents, first of all, shout out to my parents, they saw the vision. They gave me a better opportunity for just education and life period you know they get emotional you know they, they help me out a lot but they saw the vision for me and i trusted their vision came here hooped my ass off educated my ass off and uh it got me to i guess making videos for you guys <laughs> you know what's crazy that i was just thinking about the other day 
So Austin went to three different colleges. In the last college that he went to in his senior year, he graduated with a 4.0 and graduated with a degree in communications, which oh, is so you. insane. We never actually had your graduation party, so we probably need to do that sometime soon. We Maybe do during that. Vlogmas. Guys, I have my damn diploma. Yes. You have I a ha diploma. I literally graduated college with a three it wasn't a four point oh, three point eight, but still that's pretty damn. No, impressive. but you had a you had something during uh, senior year where you were like student of the entire college and it she was a 4.0 right he had a 4.0 in that time it was a hi, december hi up, and i remember hi me up. and i was so excited i was um hanging out in your dorm room pregnant. wow pregnant with l with l that's crazy this, I this is where it all started from this is crazy let's keep showing them he's going on the tour now you know what i'm gonna take him to my locker room right now i actually had a few different ones throughout the year so i remember two of them so if i can remember correctly I want to say 129 was my locker. This is the one, and it looks like someone's using it right now. Ben, Ben's using it. Ben, Ben, <laughs> oh, my man Ben. Oh shit, he's for the football team. He does. Good for him, my good for you, ben. ben. Keep it going, man. Ben, you're a light. This is crazy, this is my freshman year locker. Look how I remember that, it's crazy. <laughs> All right, so I definitely remember this locker room because this is my senior year locker room. Number 405, it looks like another football player has it. My oh, man Levi. I like how they showcase like all the sports that they play. That's awesome. And on Fridays, instead of wearing a uniform, you're able to dress up. Like you can wear your jersey on game day. That was that was. Because one thing I did hate, I ain't gonna lie, not everything was sweet here. I hated wearing my damn uniform. <laughs> Since this is a private school, you had to wear uniforms with the khaki pants and the white polo top. It just wasn't it. It wasn't it. It's cool because once you set foot on Campbell Hall campus, it's like its own little world. You can't even tell that this is in here from the outside. I never took the bus, by the way. I drove, as I said before. Wait, what was your first car? The Camaro? A Camry. I had a Camry. I used to commute every day, an hour every day to school, from home from school, in my little Camry. Oh. My grandpa helped me get that car. <laughs> I love you, Grandpa. Grandpa. Grandpa McKinley. Look at this. This is like amazing I miss this place <laughs> Al you want to come here so here's the library that I was never in but it's nice I would go in there but you got kids actually trying to study you don't want to bother them <laughs> okay you never went into the library I mean not really <laughs> kids go to the library <laughs> well base family I think that concludes my old high school tour Oh man, memories on top of memories. Maybe Elle can take over these memories, or my all my kids can take over the memories. So it's only right to close out today's video right here in the middle of my old football field. So hopefully you all enjoyed Vlogmas Day 7. Brought you guys back to history of time. Memories. <laughs> and then today's post notification shout out in $100 goes to Jackie Vibes FX. So shout out hey, to you, Hey, shout out to you, girl. We love you so much. So thank you all, Ace Family, for tuning in as always. And maybe one day we'll take you guys back to Kevin's old high school in Florida. Yeah, I would love for you to see my old high yeah. school. Yeah? Yeah. We should do that, actually. We should do that. All right. Soon. So maybe <laughs> after Vlogmas. So like me and my beautiful queen always say, we'll, we'll be back, back tomorrow. tomorrow. Peace. <laughs> Don't get hurt now. Man, if I would have stuck playing football, I'd probably be in the NFL right now. It's so nice. Ooh, I'm getting old. My back don't move the same.